of his title. How can you embarrass him? Huh? Oh, oh, I'm sorry, because you're going to pull out that you didn't drop out the fight. You just had an injury. Uh-huh. A wink, a wink. So you can't embarrass Wilder. He speaks what he says. He says what he speaks. You know, he do what he speaks. I'm sorry. You know, it, it, it just bugs me. It really, really, really starting to bug me. Just like Terrence Crawford. And somebody in the chat yesterday, I think it was yesterday, they said these damn boxers going to give us high blood pressure. And you ain't lying. I already got it. You know? They're going to make my blood pressure pop. <laughs> Shit. They didn't know I'm walking around with a stroke. You know? But no. They're not going to, uh, uh, uh. Not, not, this, not this dude. Not this OG. Uh-uh. They ain't going to give me no heart attack. Because, see, I'm going to speak what I say. I mean, uh, what I mean. I'm not going to let them get away with that shit. I'm not. You know, Cal Brook is fighting today. Uh, I'll probably come on at about 1 o'clock or 2 or something like that. But look, Cal Brook is to do a die for him. So why in the hell you worry about Earl Spence? Earl Spence is not worried about you. He don't care about you. Quit clout chasing. You don't have a bell. You don't have a rematch clause. You better try to find a way to win today. Because if you don't win today, if you still want to fight, you'll be fighting in the bars. You'll be fighting at the Blue Oyster. Huh? That's right, where they shoot pool over there. And they're stripping over there. They get lap dances over there. And you know what's going on over there. You see? You better realize. You better recognize. I'm telling you right now. Earl Spence is not thinking about your ass. And like he said, you know, uh, leave him alone. Now, he's trying to be nice. I get it. Because he's he, he brought up that way. He's a nice, respectable guy. You know? But he means what he says. But if he can't say it, I will say it. Fuck off. You don't have a, 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 a dog in this fight. So, therefore, you got to shut the fuck up. You got to go somewhere else. You see, your mistake was sticking with Eddie Hearn. He knew your value. Your value is zero. Your value is gone. When Earl took that belt from you, he broke something beside that eye socket. Y'all understand? See, look at Madonna. He broke something in AB. He broke his motherfucking wheel. He took that heart, uh, grabbed it, and hung it on his damn wall. That's why he won't let his hands go. That's why he's scared to fight. Oh, yeah. Go ahead. Call out skinny Devin Haney. Ain't in your weight class whatsoever. Then you got Lomachenko. You know, yeah, 